Let me set the scene for this next story. A woman in the back seat of a car goes into labor while her mom drives her to the hospital. But it's all happening way too fast. The baby is going to arrive before they get to a doctor. Then listen to this. Okay. The baby head is out. Okay, don't drop the baby. Just, just have her keep pushing. Is the baby completely out? I mean, it's a complete miracle. I'm a 911 operator talked them through the process of delivering a child, and they welcomed a perfect little girl into the world. It's a crazy, it's like a movie. And now this new mom wants to share her gratitude. This is a segment we're calling Thankful. And y'all please welcome new mom, Tori. All right. Tori, I need you to take us back to that day. Like, what was going on in your head? Okay, so the day before, I actually had a doctor's appointment, and um, they was removing my surgical stitch. I can't hold um, kids. So they removed it, and they told me that I was three centimeters dilated, but to go home and start walking, because it wasn't time. The next day, we had a brunch, and um, we were just eating. You know, we got to the park, and... Um, my mom, I was telling her, I was like, I'm, I'm cramping. I'm, these are contractions, I think. She was like, no, just sit down and eat that turkey leg, girl. <laughs> so, eat that turkey leg, be quiet. You're right. That's, <laughs> exactly, that's, my mom. that's exactly how she said <laughs> I, lo I love it. I relate. <laughs> yeah, so I started eating on the turkey leg, and I'm like, no. I went to the restroom, and I started bleeding, so I told her. Ooh. Yeah, and um, I kind of convinced her to go ahead and get me to the hospital. Convinced so. her? You said what, you were bleeding. Yeah, I'm like, Mom, I'm, I'm bleeding, so this is it. At that point. She called me dramatic, so. <laughs> you know what? So My you got to make sure. Too, but I actually am, so. <laughs> 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 but what was the call like with the operator, like when it was all happening? Um, okay, so my mom was really scared. Um, once I went up under the bridge, my water broke. So she called the operator, uh, well, the 911, and Mr. Chris Morris picked up the phone, and he walks her through it so calmly, you guys. With, I know you just heard her screaming like that, but she walked through it so calmly. Oh, my so God, wait, calmly. I thought that was you. No, that was my mom. <laughs> <laughs> that was my mom. <laughs> This whole time I thought, because you're delivering, but I would have been like, ah! no, like I my mom like, was doing all the screaming. Oh my, well, I think I know where she got dramatic, ma'am. Right. <laughs> that was awesome. Okay, so Tori's mom, Sanithia, is actually in the audience along with her new grandbaby, Leilani, right? Yes. Oh my God, how Say precious. Hi. So, what was it like? I mean, Oh that, my God. You were driving at first, right? Yes. Driving her to the hospital. Then yes. what, what happened? She said, Mom, she's coming. And she was opening her legs. I told her, close your legs. Close your legs. <laughs> close your legs. <laughs> That's what mamas are always telling their daughter. <laughs> <laughs> you close those legs. <laughs> and so I called the 911 operator. And I'm trying to tell him where I'm at. Do I need to stop or continue to go to the hospital? And I was so scared, y'all. I, I, like burst out in sweat immediately, and he's telling me what to do. All of a sudden, she just popped out head first. Oh. I'm like, oh my God, I see her head, but not the rest of her body. <laughs> and he told me she had to push again. Oh. She came out, and I was so, I guess you know, as a mom, you want to take them. And I just took her, and I'm like, Tori's like, Mom. I'm like, oh, and I seen the umbilical cord. <laughs> I'm like, oh, my God. <laughs> I know. Well, you're not used to being in that position. And I'm sorry. Right. Doctor, so. <laughs> and at the same time, I'm waving to the paramedics, the ambulance. Here I am, here I am. And they was like, oh, you already delivered the baby. I'm like, <laughs> uh, I yeah. am a goddess. Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I did that. That's am and what an amazing story, though, for Leilani growing up. The fact that everybody's healthy and safe, it's the most amazing part of yeah. the story. Well done giving birth. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Thank you. So I actually heard about when they were coming on. I actually heard, Kristen, you have actually helped deliver four babies. I have. Yes. Where were so you? We should talk. I know. Right. <laughs> <It's> a mess. <laughs> Woo! 
Oh, um, how? Why? Um, two, when I, I volunteered in between my freshman and sophomore year of college in Brazil, and I was volunteering at a hospital with some doctors and nurses that came over in a very underfunded hospital. And two, the, I was there for two months, and two times women walked in and were like, let's do this, and there is no anesthesia there. There is oh, nothing. Out. They didn't even have, sometimes we didn't even have gloves, and they were like, get ready to catch. There was one Brazilian nurse there, and um, it was unbelievable. And then mm. I do a show called Momsplaining, um, yeah. and it, I said, I really want a live birth, and two women let us be in the delivery room, and I was, last year, holding legs back, in the splash zone. In the splash zone. Yeah, just watching these beautiful. I know what that's like. it, yeah, and you can't. I did. I did nothing all four times but cry. Now I I travel with a catcher's mitt because I feel like it comes to me like, in case I need yeah. to be ready. I'm your girl. Um, Got yeah. you. But it's so beautiful. I was sobbing all four times. It's so beautiful. What to an see amazing a baby. life you've led Come to have done. That's random. That's that is so cool. Yeah, so how is little Leilani doing? She's doing great. Um, when she was born, she was 5'5", five, five, and she came four weeks early. So now she's uh, 11 pounds, and she's eating. <laughs> That's good. Healthy baby. Healthy and my lovely angel. Oh, I'm so she's excited so for y'all. That's such a beautiful story, how that ended. I, thank you so much for coming and sharing that with us, y'all. You've stayed in touch with Chris, right? I did. He never delivered a child before. He oh. don't have kids of his own. He had never delivered a child before like that, and he just And was he was calm? so calm. And again, my mom was the only one doing all the screaming. Yeah, I How love that that ended that. up being you. <laughs> that was my favorite part of the show. <laughs> well, here's the thing. Um, Chris is here. And he is eager to meet Tori and Leilani in person. How does that sound? Yes, yes. I haven't met him. Let's bring him out. <laughs> I'm great. How are you doing, Chris? I'm good. I'm over here. You? Except watch this. We try and trick people. <laughs> nice to see you. Thank you. How are you so calm in that, man? <laughs> hey, hey, how are you? Thank you so much. It's so nice to finally meet you. All right, so wait. Hey, you take my seat because we're not scooting down. So, are you you want to scoot? Oh, oh I'll sit goodness. by baby love. You take my seat here. I'll sit right by. <laughs> I'll sit here. I'm, here we go. I'm we just, the baby, we just separated your child. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Do you want her? No, okay, fine. I do. Thank you. Oh, I do. <laughs> <laughs> Try to be polite. So wait, tell us about you getting a call and being like, well, there's a baby on the way. Like, what kind of protocol is set up for that? You've never done that before. Like, well, are you Well, I mean, terrified? I've been doing this about eight years, and we do, um, you know, we have uh, certain things that we, we're, we're trained to do, uh, different protocols, but this one was different because she was driving down the side of the highway, and uh, my main focus was just trying to keep her and her mom calm as, as I could. Really, just until, her mom? <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> until we can get the paramedics there to help them. Yeah. But when she said the baby was coming, you know, I just had to get her to pull over. And we had to do what we had to do. Good on right. you. Like, Sanithia, yeah. do you want to say anything to Chris? Thank you so much. I don't know what I would have done without you. I really don't. You're welcome. Um, it's my pleasure. They let me cut the umbilical cord. Oh. Oh, and it was just so amazing. And he's like, how did you do it? And I'm like, the 911 operator. <laughs> he told me everything. Yeah. <laughs> so by the time I cut the cord, the, I thought I was a pro. Thank you so <laughs> much. <laughs> it's harder to cut than it looks, isn't it? Yeah. It's quite tough. It's My husband really cut the tough. cord on both of ours, and he was like, at first one, I couldn't get through it. Yeah. I couldn't get through it. I had to ask oh for God. assistance. It takes a couple it's like a rubber hose. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. It's so real. <laughs> um, but wait, Tori, you have a special question, right? If you ever saw Chris, you wanted to ask, right? Yeah. Would you like to be her godmother? I mean, godfather, I'm sorry. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, my God. That's that's really a great honor. Thank you. Yeah, sure. Absolutely. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> that's so amazing. Like, you're you such a hero in that moment, Chris. Yeah. Such a hero. Yeah. Look at you. Your husband is so scared right now. <laughs> <I know. laughs> Wow. All right, well, there's something that you'd like to share with the family, right, Kristen? Yeah, so my husband and I actually um, started a baby care company about a year and a half ago called Hello Bello, which is available online at hellobello.com and at Walmart. And the idea behind it was we wanted to have premium ingredients that we have access to at all these little L.A. boutiques accessible at a price point that parents don't have to break their budget for. No parent should choose between their 
baby or their budget because parenting is hard and I'm sure you're in the thick of it right now. And you so. want the best. <laughs> yeah, you want kids. the best for your kid. Absolutely. And everyone deserves the best or at least options. Um, so we at Hello Bello wanted to give you um, a free year. So the first year, everything will be on us. Order whatever you want. Are you all her dining right now? All her, no. <gasps> that is the, I will call and, this and this beautiful basket. But yeah, you'll have, you'll get a code and anything that you need um, will be yours for free because you are such a warrior. And we are very proud that Thank she's here. So. We like to say that it's your mom's ingredients and your dad's price point because my husband's really cheap and I'm, I really like good ingredients. <laughs> I love y'all, I love y'all. I am so excited for you. What a blessing that gift Thank is. You. Whoa, okay. I will not stop talking until you subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's right, and I can talk a lot. Seriously, not gonna stop. Yep, still here, not going anywhere. I see you. Don't walk away from this.